Hey, what's up Drumios? My name is Dave Atkinson and I'm a Drumio instructor. And today I wanted to teach you what I like to call the slide triplet. It's what I just played for you, but more importantly, I wanna show you how you can actually use it in a pretty cool sounding beat. Now the slide triplet is what I call it. However, if you play heel toe, you might wanna call it the heel toe triplet. Or if you guys play a different technique on there, call it what you want. The, the, the name of it doesn't really matter. It's all about what you actually do. Now the main aspect of this is playing two notes on your right foot followed by one note on your left foot. So you're gonna need a double bass pedal for this. And if you know the slide technique or the heel toe technique, it's gonna help you out all the better. How you do it is play two notes, like I said, on your right foot, followed immediately by one note on your left foot. Together, they sound like this. You can almost hear a gallop there. And I like to play this pattern in a triplet format. And in the groove that I'm gonna show you, it's gonna be in 60th note triplets. Now there is a certain tempo that you're gonna to have to play this at in order to actually utilize the slide technique or the heel toe technique. And you'll find that yourself. If you play it too slow, you might as well just play two singles followed by a single with your left foot. So keep that in mind when you're practicing these. Now let's apply this to a really cool sounding groove. If you look at the sheet music, it's a very simple rock beat that you guys have probably already played before. Without the slide triplet, here's what it sounds like. So hopefully you guys have heard that beat before and hopefully many of you can already play it. What we're gonna do now is we're gonna add the slide triplet on the and of three right before the last backbeat to get that almost like a galloping kind of feel. Da, 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 da. Okay, so if we're counting this, one and two and three and triplet four. Now I'm not gonna play it on the snare, you're gonna play that and triplet on your feet with the slide triplet. So like this. Okay, so take it slow like that at first, then speed it up. Let's try it with a metronome slow and then a little bit faster. Here we go. You can also try doubling up that slide triplet. So instead of doing it on the and of three, try doing it on the and of one. So you're getting two slide triplets in the groove. Check it out, it sounds like this. Now some of you might ask, why can't I just play singles? And you can, but I just like the feel of this. This technique is so versatile in 16th notes, in triplets, around the kit, and once you get the feel going and you can understand how you can use it, it's a lot of fun. So I hope this challenges you and inspires you, and I hope you can pick it up and have a lot of fun with it yourself. And if you like this concept and you like what I'm teaching here, you have to check out Drumeo Edge. We have a ton of lessons just like this that take this technique and this concept even further. We have a great deal going on right now for new members, so check it out, drumeo.com, and I'll see you there. Cheers.